today I am bringing you another haul. I'm super excited. I love hauls and summer is officially here, baby. So we are going to bring you some more summer hauls or I'm going to bring you some more summer hauls because I love hauls and I think you guys love hauls. So yeah, without further ado, let's get right into the video. So this haul is in collaboration with NAKD.com. It's not sponsored. They didn't pay me to do this video. They just sent me a couple of things, asked me if I wanted to talk about them, and I was like, yeah, why not? They have really cute stuff. Um, I'm actually wearing one of the tops today, and this choker is connected with the top. Can we talk about it? I'm obsessed. So, yeah, I do have a discount code for you guys. It is CHELSEA20 for 20% off, and they have free shipping worldwide. So, with my discount code and free shipping, you guys can really go in on that website and get some really nice things. This shirt in particular is great great quality it has like a thicker material and it's stretchy but it's like stretchy in the best way like it's perfect and the choker part just connects right onto the shirt and it's a little crop top these right here this off the shoulder little thing that's going on is perfect too because you don't have to worry about it falling like it's never gonna fall because this choker is connected with the sh with the shirt so obsessed love this shirt Need I say more? So the next item I'm going to show you guys is another off-the-shoulder top. I think you guys are going to be so for my off-the-shoulder obsession, but can't help it. It's really my favorite kind of style of a shirt to wear, and it has been for years. If I can find a picture of me wearing an off-the-shoulder shirt from back in the day, I might link that for you guys. But anyway, I love off-the-shoulder, so this is another kind of style that I've been seeing a lot with this kind of sleeve little detail going on that has, oh what is that little string there? It has like a little bow on the sides and it has like almost like a bell sleeve and then this off the shoulder thing going on here. It's so cute, obsessed, it's, I'm obsessed with everything apparently. It's so cute, it's just nice and flowy and easy for the spring and summer. Throw on some white shorts, some gladiator sandals and you're done, like perfect little outfit. It does have little slits on the side too, which again, just so nice and airy and comfortable um, and it is a little see-through. I'm cool with that because again, I'm just gonna probably wear like a nude bra underneath and just let it flow Like be nice and flowy and comfortable The only thing I will say about um, this particular brand because they have a bunch of other brands on their website that you can shop from They have like Cheap Monday and a bunch of other ones But um, this is from their actual brand which I, again, I love their material and their quality This is a medium and I would say these items that I'm gonna show you all were a little bit big for me So I can make them work but I prefer if I got it in a small. Um, and I'm usually pretty much a straight up medium, but just so you guys know, I would maybe be a little careful if anything maybe size down if you're not sure. Um, but if you're like, oh, I think that's going to be fine in my regular size, then I would just get a medium. Because this actually fits perfect. I think in a small, this would have been too constricting. This neck part would have been too tight, and over here I wouldn't have been able to breathe. But all the other things, I could have gotten in a small, I'm pretty sure. So anyway, still love this stuff, and like I said, I can still make it work. It's just... A little tiny bit bigger than I would like. Okay, so the next thing is this black long dress. Um, and it has kind of like, um, I guess it's ribbed, if you want to call it that. And it has these two little buttons in the back that you just kind of, I don't know if you guys can see, but you'll see it kind of when I'm trying it on. But it has little two buttons in the back. It goes high neck, and it has a really nice slit. This is a more of a midi style dress. It could even be a maxi on some people, but for me it's definitely a midi, and I'm pretty sure this is marketed as a midi, mini dress, mini or mini? Get it together. Midi dress. Um, but this is like one of the items where, since it's like that stretchy material, and it's meant to be tight, I would have liked it in a small. Totally fine, can still work it out like I said, but nice simple black dress, can't have too many LBDs. The next thing I have here is this little tank top kind of dress. This one also has slits, but it has slits on both sides and it's a nude color. Um, you guys know my palette, nude, white, black. And then I'll occasionally mix in that kind of blue color because it reminds me of jean, so it's kind of like a neutral. So this is in a size medium again, like I said, and it is nice and stretchy and comfortable. This is a really nice, comfy, soft, well-made kind of tank top dress. So if you're looking for one of those, I would definitely try to check these out. Um, and yeah, just nothing much to say about it. You could dress it up, dress it down, sneakers or heels, and you're good to go. The last clothing item I picked up before I show you one bathing suit and two little accessories is this dress here. This was the dress that I was talking about that I would wear more for fall. It is so pretty and the material again, I like it a lot. Um, it's a little bit more weighted, I guess, than like a Shein side or something like that. I, I love Shein side still. I just did a blog post wearing this Shein side dress that I love, but 
in other words it is a little bit better quality than those kind of websites um, and it's just a nice black simple dress again it goes a nice high neck over here you have the buttons in the back a belt and then you have a nice sleeve like a dressy sleeve and it's like up to my knee and I would wear this with probably my black over the knee Stuart Weitzman boots you can also wear this with heels but that's how I pictured it when I saw it um, and it, it'd be nice for like something where you need to be a little dressy but not too dressy or you could actually really dress this up so it really just depends it's versatile 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 like I said little black dresses you can never have too many they're just so convenient and they go with so many things and yeah okay so I got one bathing suit and this was in a collab in collaboration with somebody I guess a blogger because I didn't recognize her when I saw oh here's her name Josephine Ekstrom you guys know who that is I'm, I'm not sure but I just thought it was cute and I've seen this kind of bathing suit going around um, and I figured I would get it from them because I feel like again their quality is a little bit better than most so over here is a nice little white bathing suit with a tie up front which if you had bigger boobs I probably it would probably look so sexy on you but I have no boobs so it's not like that sexy it's kind of just like whatever but it's still really cute and the low back is just I think the sexiest part about it. It also has um, like a little line here that kind of defines your waist a little bit and it's not too cheeky it's pretty much like a normal bottom nothing too crazy um, and yeah like I said the material is great I got this in a medium I, I think as well I think I got everything in a medium except did I get anything in it? I think I got everything in a medium yeah so that makes it easier for you guys but you guys know I link everything and my sizes down below so yeah there was that little bathing suit and then two accessories one is my phone case you guys know my obsession with Marvel and I had a white one on my phone not too long ago if you guys um, remember but I was getting tired of it and it, since it was white it was getting kind of dirty and it wasn't this material where this like soft kind of rubbery material so it wasn't too great when it, my phone fell I mean I have cracks and stuff on my phone right now but I really like this one if you're looking for a super protective phone case I wouldn't recommend this one because it doesn't go all the way around the phone or all the way on the bottom but if you're just looking for something cute that's semi-protective um, I would recommend this one it's just really cute you know <laughs> and then the last thing I got was this choker. I fell into the whole choker craze. I was never really into it, especially the 90s like plastic ones. Like I wore those back in the day and I I don't know, I never got excited to wear them again with this whole craze that's out now, but um I decided to just get one. I could see myself wearing this now more um in certain with certain looks. So this is just a black choker and it's like suede you know like those suede kind of ones actually let's open it I didn't even open it so it's really just like a black string but if you want one that's specifically to for it to be a choker then I guess why not order it right so I mean like I said you could probably just make this but I decided to order it and I like that I could just wrap this around as many times as I want or I could do that bow thing that's in also right now or you do like the bow in the front I don't know just a little cute something to have. Alright guys, so that's going to complete my haul today with NAKD.com. Like I said, I have a coupon code for you guys, Chelsea20 for 20% 20 off. And they have free worldwide shipping, so you guys can go ham on that website. Like I already said, go in. Um, I really recommend them. I think they were awesome. Again, I'm going to go do a blog post right now because I just really love this shirt. I don't know, I just... I just love it. Isn't it so flattering? So anyway, thank you guys for watching. I love you guys. Please check the description box for all the links and everything that you may need. It's probably down there, but if you do have a question, you guys know, I always answer everybody in the comments, so just leave it in the comments, and I usually get back to you guys within like a day. So, all right, I guess that's it. I love you guys. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I am throwing at you some overrated beauty products that I'm kind of tired of hearing about that I don't feel like are worth the hype. Um, and yeah, that just didn't work for me.